In this video I want to share with you everything you need to know when going to Tenerife in June. What the weather is going to be like but also more exactly what to expect, what's going to be opened, what's going to be closed at that time of year, where you should be staying at that time of year to have the best holiday and if it's actually the right time for you to go on holiday or not. And don't worry if we figure out it's not the right time then there's also a full guide in this video to when to go exactly. June is one of the hottest summer months on Tenerife with a high average temperature of 26 degrees and a low average temperature of 90 degrees but do know that these are averages so there's also going to be plenty of days and time of day it's going to be much warmer than this June together with May and July are the sunniest months on Tenerife with on average 14 hours of sunshine each day if you don't want any rain during your holiday, know that June is a great time to go to Tenerife because normally June doesn't have any rainy days. If you want to spend most of the time on the beach sunbathing, then this is actually one of the best times to go. June is actually one of the first months on Tenerife the water temperature becomes quite nice and comfortable with 22 degrees most people will enjoy swimming in this water but it's still not too hot so it's still quite nice and refreshing. June is a part of the two high seasons you will find here on the island of Tenerife so all the parks definitely will be open at this time of year but do know that some parks on the island start to get a little bit crowdy around this time. Also in June you can expect all the bars and restaurants on the island to be definitely open. If you like to go clubbing or partying or have an active nightlife then pretty much you can find this all over the island at this time of year. But if you really want to go for it then of course you won't be heading to Playa de las Americas. When it comes to pricing on Tenerife you should know that this month is a very popular month on the island and this also means that prices in general all over the island are going to be pretty high. Taking into account pricing, weather, but also what is open, the following are the best destinations in my opinion on the island this time of year. These are Golf del Sur, Costa del Silencio, Palm Mar, Los Cristianos, Playa de las Americas, Costa Adeje, Playa Paraíso, Callao Salvaje, Puerto de Santiago, Los Gigantes, Puerto de la Cruz and Santa Cruz. Hi, my name is Eve. I lived, traveled and worked all over the Spanish islands for the last 20 years. So definitely if you want to have the best holiday possible, have a look at these videos as well and subscribe and click the bell notification because once a week I come online here live and answer all your holiday related questions live here on YouTube. So make sure to subscribe, click the bell, then you are informed next time I am live.